The woman is in jail after police say she took a yes. knife to Shelby Farms Park and threatened a park visitor. Hello, I'm Stephanie Skurlock. And I'm Greg Kirsch. Hey, WRG's Bria Jones joins us now live outside the Shelby County Criminal Justice Center after speaking with the victim. And Bria, what did she have to say? Well, the victim says that the woman never attacked her with the knife, but she did suffer from a racially motivated verbal attack. Just past this crosswalk at Shelby Farms is where police say 52-year-old Melissa Pruitt crossed the line. I hear her screaming at me like she was saying some other stuff. She kept saying like, you terrorists, some spewing like racial slurs. And Stephanie Mosby says Pruitt aggressively approached her with a knife as if she would stab her Saturday afternoon while she was walking her dog on the Green Line near Mullen Station in Farm Road. I was kind of like, honestly, in a state of shock. It was like a like like a kitchen. Hold idea. on. Wait a second. How can you be shocked by this? This country is nakedly and irredeemably racist. Biden oh, was right. That's this a proves, good point. This proves Biden was right. <laughs> yeah, real shit. Real yeah, shit. Biden just said the other day that the biggest threat to this country is white supremacy. He said that at Howard's fucking commencement. So think about that, man. You're shocked. Why? This this is your reality, right? In Farm Road. I was kind of like, honestly, in a state of shock. It was like a like like a kitchen knife you would see like in a, like a horror film, like silver, and then like a black black edge. Thankfully, she says another woman pulled over to help. But Pruitt continued to yell racial slurs from a distance. It also was like kind of crazy to me because there was like other people, of, there was like other white people that were just like going by her and she wouldn't do anything. But it, you're calling us names like this 2023. Why are you being like this? While alarming. What does 2023 have to do with it? <laughs> is she black? Right. Is this woman black? What is she? She's something. She's something. What, what, what she meant to say is not again. Yeah, yeah, exactly. God, <laughs> always happens every time. Those, those man, I'm telling you, those white supremacists, man, they gotta stop. Yeah, Jesus Christ, golly gee. You like this? While alarming, park visitors say the behavior doesn't surprise them. Somebody like that just probably woke up and snapped. I'm not surprised because <laughs> we're in Memphis, of course, but I've been coming to the park for. She's not surprised well, because they're in Memphis. Yeah. Well, I mean, I don't blame people. I blame everybody in Memphis is about to snap. I Did think. you hear the lady? The black lady said, "Like, oh yeah, she about like you can't blame she. Like, what? What about us and shit? Like, what about the shit we do every fucking day? Like, I don't know. right? Why? Why can't this bitch get the mental health pass? That's what right. I'm saying. Exactly. Shout out to Ty M coming through. Salute to you, bro. Just probably woke up and snapped. Um. Not surprised because we're in Memphis, of course, but I've been coming to the park for 10 years at least. I'm out here almost every day. I never feel unsafe. As for Pruitt, police say she possibly suffers from mental illness, which has those concerned calling for more resources. I feel like we need more mental health counselors. Shut the fuck up. Why whenever some one fucking person snaps out, we need all this, the city failed them, all this bullshit. I'm tired of all this shit. Every time one fucking crazy person, you encounter a crazy person. Well, Fuck what, them. What, you don't, what you don't realize is that Melissa Pruitt was at one time, 10 years ago, an incredible Madonna impersonator. Mm. A beloved Madonna impersonator. <laughs> yeah. Right. Facts. For mental illness, which has those concerned calling for more resources. I feel like we need more mental health counselors on, on site at places like this because sometimes people come to the park because they feel depressed. Regardless, Mosby says she's pressing charges. It was racially charged, in my opinion. Regardless of like what mental state she was in, it's like... You see, don't see that, white people? <laughs> Regardless of what mental state she was in, I'm pressing charges. Fuck that shit. I don't hear about your fucking mental illness, bitch. You going to jail. <laughs> yeah, Real shit. Well, well, I mean, but you know what? And Biden's gonna invite her to the White House too. Yeah. But but come on, Ag, let's be. I'm 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 being. I'm not joking when I say this. What this girl did to this other girl, that's she's not right for that. She's wrong as fuck for that. However, yeah. when you compare it to all the other shit that you know who will be doing, this is nothing. Nothing. But it's still wrong. Yeah.
Mosley says she's like the good old night fight with them black girls. Charged, in my opinion, regardless of like what mental state she was in, it's like you obviously are a, a racist Karen. She called her a Karen. That's it's a like, racist. She term. she called her a racist Karen. And it's just like them two oh, black girls that's having a good old night fight. Yeah, this is this is. But but I mean is isn't like calling somebody a Karen isn't that like isn't racist implied already so do you gotta yeah, say absolutely. racist Karen exactly 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 you're white the only person that could be a Karen is a white person in charge of the aggravated assault she's currently being held on a twenty thousand dollar bond she said to appear this white lady got a twenty thousand dollar bond meanwhile that guy that uh, other guy is to... that other guy was shot at cops. Him. Rob sixty thousand bucks and he's walking around probably on about the same amount of well, he no, got fifty he got a fifty thousand dollar bill. Yeah, that, I mean, come on, unbelievable, man. Uh, speaking of Karen's, Karen was trending today too. That's on Twitter all day, man. I was like, I had to fucking. I was like, what the fuck? Karen is trending. Um, so. Let's see what what why Karen was trending. Let's see some of these Karen situations, man. Um, that were trending. Let that man, that man ain't calling you, bro. I want you to be doing the best you can. You probably like it. It doesn't matter what I like. I can tell you don't like it. Well, too bad. Go someplace else. Go to Burger King. Have it your way. Have it your way at Burger King. We're going to sh